Well, hello and good morning. It's Saturday the 20th of May 2017. It's a bit chilly, um, but it's also sunny and there's the odd spot of rain with a little bit more forecast. So who knows? Anyway, oh six thirty hours, British summer time. Summer time, summer time. Summer actually starts 10 days, 11 days, 12 days. <laughs> oh gosh, getting old. I've done my knee in, my memory's going. I have a free drinks voucher in Starbucks. I'm going to pop in the Tom Toy Lewis. I think it's going to be good. Anyway, less rabbiting, more drinking. It's sunny, but it's still cool. So I'm going for a coffee with my free drink. Hopefully I'll get cream on the top. Wow. Guess what's for sale? It's huge. Holy. Well, actually, yeah, holy. And this is not for sale now. Doesn't time fly? Hmm. January 2016, the last time I was here. This the one I think, and well, this is the one. Thomas Watkin, IPA. 4.8% alcohol by volume. Did you say no tomato or you got tomato? Table number one. Definitely table number one. Carpet again for Mr. Manning. hint of fruit, nothing special, I wouldn't call it an IPA, B plus. It's spotting rain, I'm not sure if they'll have anything on, but I'm going to have a little look, so maybe just the one. I was right, just the one, and the fridge came to the rescue. Now this used to be brilliant. It is a little cold, although not as cold as the fridge normally is. It smells like it's seen its best days. Yeah, it's definitely seen better days. B plus in a bit. Oh, things were much better then in other ways, and now they're much better. Life. The John Wallace Linton in Wales. It is really just the one day. Anyway, carpet for Mr. Manning. This is Swordfish by Wadsworth, 5% alcohol by volume, it's supposed to be rum infused. Oh. Heads disappeared, never mind. Not much of an aroma. Mm. Getting that, I don't know what rum really tastes like, but there's a rather complex finish which is long and very pleasant. E plus in a bit, I think. Yes, indeed. Okay, it's the white one, but it's rather grey. And I'm behind schedule. But it's great. Ah, unfortunately, the TV is broken. However, there's one over there. Carpet for Mr. Manning. Grey skies. Touch of drizzle. This is Lemon Brew from Cockley. We're in Somerset, where I was last week. 4.3% alcohol by volume New Zealand hops. 
in a brain's glass. Slightly too cold, I'd say. Gentle hoppy aroma. Aye, uh, not very much. I'd say hint of lemon. Getting it more in the finish. B plus. Turn the music off, I'll go take that. It is rather grey. It's not raining. And still behind schedule. Still happy. Still on the prey chips. We have Google say we can improve this video. But only by adding the new salt. Newport Market, Newport Tiny Rebel. Oh, let's not try and get run over. Yay. Going that way. Oh, not that way. So, where we go. I love these tables because I'll adjust my colour temperature against them. This is Divine Comedy by Slopian Brewery at 3.9% alcohol by volume. That's my one plus 3D which is heating up. Come on, get the update out. Okay. Get the aroma. Oh, and it's heavy rain outside. Coffee, but sort of creamy. Big plus in the bed. Happy tiny rabbit day. What's your smooch? Jumbles? Jumbles? Anyway. Seville Orange Sour by Cloudwater, 3.5% alcohol by volume in a tiny rebel glass. Color temperature, the rain has now stopped. It smells fruity. Check the acidic and sour. Better if it's a little warmer. I'm going to go with B plus plus because I think it's going to get better. I'll come back to this. Okay, let's go Norwegian. This is from the Ludwig Brewery. Fashion Tang 7.0. This is 7. Oh, sorry. Um, it's a sour passion fruit beer. Okay, huge passion fruit aroma. Mm. Really, really good actually. Oh, I like that. Bottle conditioned, I was careful. Really, really good. B plus plus in a bit, 3.75 on the untapped scale. And Norway, well, Norway is difficult for drinking, but I really like that. This is a sort of summery, sunny day drink. I like it. I really thought I had gamma ray. I beat the tone. I couldn't focus on it. Hope I told on that tap. Okay, I thought. I like the beef with that board. It's something they think about. It's a little bit of a part of the building. It's a little bit of a 